Hi, I'm Matt Stroll with RV1 Superstores. I'm here to go over the all new and exciting Zinger by Crossroads. Starting off at the front of the unit, there's so many phenomenal features. I'm really, really excited. We're gonna start off at the bottom here with the actual steel I-beam frame. This frame is unlike any other frame in the industry because it's actually powder coated with a rust inhibitor. Most brands just put any old frame on their unit and then when it shows up to the dealer's lot, it's already rusted out, not with the crossroads. All their frames are powder coated with rust inhibitor. So they're gonna stay true and they're gonna look resilient and hold up for many years to come, giving you better resale value on your Zinger. Swing over to the 20 pound propane tank bottles. There's not just one, but there's actually two. And there's actually a ABS cover that comes with it a lot of brands, you have to pay extra for the ABS cover. This is actually gonna protect your tanks from rust, corrosion over time. There's no extra charge for that cover. That's a big deal with the Zinger. Swinging over to the front, you actually have a 3,500 pound electric power tongue jack with the LED light and up and down directional right here. And there's also an override plug right up at the top. Swing on over to the left corner, you'll notice a nice emblem that actually identifies the three-year structural warranty on the Crossroads Zinger travel trailer. This is amazing, folks. Most brands will only give you a one-year warranty. If you're lucky, they might give you a two, but not with the Zinger. It actually has a three-year structural warranty. That's unlike any other manufacturer out there. That's phenomenal. That means when you go put your travel trailer away the first year, you have total coverage a second. And not only that, you actually have another year of coverage for the third year. That's amazing, most brands won't give you that. Come on over to the campsite side of the unit. You have a huge, huge storage compartment with rounded corners. Opening the compartment up, you'll actually notice it has massive pass-through storage. And not only does it have one huge storage compartment door, but you have another big one on the other side. So if you had huge, let's say fishing poles, lawn chairs, they're easy to get in and out equally. And the other neat thing, most brands, most people don't notice this, but most brands actually don't put a storage compartment door on the off campsite side. So Zinger is gonna give you two storage compartment doors just for ease of access. That's a big deal. Swing on over to the top of the unit. The roof is actually made of Superflex. It's a one ply TPO material. It's a reflective material in nature. It actually has a 12 year warranty on it. Most brands might give you a two or three year warranty on their roof, not with the Zinger. You actually have a 12 year warranty on their Superflex TPO material. Unlike the EPDM rubber material that you'll see on most travel trailers, it's actually about a third of the weight. So you have more cargo carrying capacity for your travel trailer and your goods to bring with you on your camping trip. But it actually doesn't have the chalking that you'll get with some of the other rubberized roofing materials on some of the other cheaper trailers. So keep in mind, you're gonna get your Superflex 12 year warranty roof material on your Zinger. That's amazing. Most brands just won't do that for you. Swing over to the entry door. The cool thing with the entry door, this isn't like any other entry door. It actually has a friction hinge on it, folks. So you actually have one, two, three hinges on the entry door. The neat thing, the friction hinge won't get slammed in any wind storms and with inclement weather, sometimes swinging on over the six gallon hot water heater. It's not just like all the other six gallon hot water heaters. This is actually in a Dometic hot water heater with gas and electric capability. So it has DSI, direct spark ignition. So let's say in the morning you get up and you say, hey honey, I wanna go uh, take a nice hot shower. You don't have to come outside and light your hot water heater with lighter, you can actually just swing over, press the button, direct spark ignition, very easy to use, and uh, you don't have to worry about it. Over to the left, this is where you have your fresh water fill. Swing on up, this unit actually comes standard with outdoor marine grade speakers with LED lighting inside the speakers. You heard me correct, it actually has LED lighting inside the speakers, that's awesome, it just gives it a really fun atmosphere out in, in front of your Zinger. Not only does it have that, but your huge, massive, look how big this awning is. A lot of brands will just put the, the small little awning on there that's maybe 
10, 8 foot long awning. This is, goes almost the full length of the travel trailer. That's amazing. It encompasses the door and your outdoor kitchen, which is amazing. That's, that's where it counts, folks. You're outside camping. Let's say it rains. I mean, we're in Florida right now. It rains about 30% of the time. You want to make sure you're covered. Zinger definitely has you covered with that massive awning. It's a power awning with an LED light strip. Come standard at that super, super low sale price. That's awesome. Down below, let's talk about the ride on the Zinger. This is phenomenal, folks. This unit actually has two Dexter axles with a five-year warranty on it. This unit, at this price point, it's pretty unheard of because the Dexter axles are the same axles that an Airstream travel trailer has been using for 85 years, and that's on a $100,000 travel trailer. This unit has Dexter axles, and it's a fraction of the cost. I don't know how they did it, but they did. That, that's awesome. The other nice thing with these tires, you actually have nitrogen filled tires. They're going to run cooler and it's going to be a lot less likely that you're going to have blowouts than the traditional air filled tires that most other brands have. Swing on over, you also have easy lube uh, bearings, so you don't uh, have to maintain them as often or it's just, I should say, it's actually a lot easier to maintain. Above your wheels is even more impressive. I don't know if you can get this on camera, but this is just super super critical that we talk about it you actually have a galvanized steel wheel well most brands in this price point will not even go there but zinger does and they they go at it hard you actually have galvanized steel wheel well it's going to protect the travel trailer unlike anybody else most brands believe it or not will put maybe a piece of plastic maybe a piece of darko fabric i've actually seen that this unit, the Zinger, actually comes with a galvanized steel wheel well. That's going to protect the travel trailer in the event of any road debris you get into on the road. Remember, you're going 65 miles an hour down the road. You know, you might run over something. In the event of a tire blowout, it's not going to disintegrate the side of the trailer. Most brands, if you have a tire, it's a trip ender, I would call it. Not with the Zinger. You actually have galvanized steel wheel well that's going to protect your investment and your family for years to come. That's a big deal. Swing on up, you also have additional two GFCI protected outlets for radios or I should say a TV actually because you do have your outdoor uh, stereo. Uh, you also have cable hook up here so if you want to put a TV outside you can do that. This is absolutely the most well thought out outdoor kitchen I've ever seen folks. Look at all the storage here. You actually have a shelf, massive shelf. Let me just, let's get a good shot of that. Look, at, look how big that shelf is up here. Pots, pans, utensils, you name it, plates. You can put it all up there. You don't have to keep on running in and outside the trailer. A lot of times when these manufacturers put together outdoor kitchens, they usually leave something out. They might leave out the refrigerator. They might leave out, look at this. You actually have a hot and cold sink here. That, I'd probably say 85% of outdoor kitchens do not have a sink. The Zinger gives it to you. Not only do they give you the sink, but it has hot and cold water, it has an awesome refrigerator with the thermostat, and then you actually have a huge two burner stove cooktop. So you have two burners with one that actually has high output with the uh, wind guards here on the side and then awesome storage up top. It's easy to use, just rolls right in. Swing on to the back, folks. If you swing up to the top, just below your marker lights, you're gonna notice it actually comes standard. It's prepped for a Furion backup camera. Safety's a big deal with the Zinger, and I'm sure it is with a lot of your families out there. Zinger's not gonna forget about you here, so it's actually prepped for the backup camera. It's a very small cost if you want to add the camera because all the wiring is already there and you don't have to worry about it. This actually comes with a full-size spare tire. Some brands just won't give you a spare tire, folks. It might cost two, three, four hundred dollars for an additional spare tire, not with the Zinger at that special sale price. Comes with it. And it actually comes with the U-bolt and the bracket. 
So a lot of brands will say, yeah, I can throw in the spare tire, and you actually have to take the spare tire and put it up in your valuable storage compartment up front. Not with the Zinger, they're actually gonna give you the tire carrier and the actual tire itself and rim at no charge. That's huge. Swing on over to the off campsite side. At that super low price, you also have a huge outside shower with a four foot hose, comes out even farther. And it's actually hot and cold water. A lot of brands will just put cold water if they do give you an outdoor shower, not the Zinger. They give you hot and cold water for your comfort. Swing on over to the slide room. This is super important. If we can get a good shot of this, uh, it's very, very important. This actually has a, a four seal system slide room. This is actually an engineered track that this bulb seal actually fits right into. The reason why we're going over that and why it's so important is most brands don't put their bulb seals on a track. If I wanted to get this off this unit, I'd have a hard time. I probably can't even do it. You also have three additional seals on the inside over here, just to make sure you, you stay nice and dry inside and you don't have any water leaks. A lot of brands don't think of those little things that add up in the end. Swing on down to the bottom. I know we talked about the upgraded stabilizer jacks, but what we didn't talk about is even more important. Actually, above that, this unit comes standard with a heated and enclosed underbelly. That's super impressive at that sale price. So this actually comes with a fully enclosed underbelly. It's called polypropylene. It's 10 times more tear resistant than aluminum. Think about that. The Zinger comes standard with it. That's amazing. Usually brands that are 50, $60,000 more have those features. The Zinger comes standard with a heated enclosed underbelly. That's gonna protect the undercarriage and then in inclement weather, if you go camping, let's say up north, you actually have a forced 30,000 BTU furnace that's ducted right underneath your undercarriage to keep everything nice and, and comfortable in the, in the colder climate. Let's swing inside. Coming into the all new Zinger by Crossroads, the inside is just as phenomenal as the outside. Let's check out the master suite in this, in this room. This is phenomenal. Right when you go to the front of the room, your master suite, your bed actually has gas struts for your storage capability down below. So you actually don't have to hold it up if you don't want to. I'm actually not using hands right now, which is kind of cool. So it just gives me free access and full utility of what I'm working with. So you actually have gas struts come standard and then you can see the phenomenal woodwork that they use framing in the, the actual bed itself. This unit actually comes standard with the bedspread. Some brands you actually have to pay extra for the bedspread, not with the Zinger. Above the light, or excuse me, above the head of the bed, you actually have a nice reading light and you also have mood lighting. It actually comes with mood lighting. I don't know many trailers that actually come with mood lighting, but the Zinger actually does. If you don't want the mood lighting on because you're maybe not in the mood, uh, you can turn that off. If you want it on, of course you can turn it back on and all their lights are LED lights. So they're more energy efficient, it's more of a true light and it just makes it more comfortable inside, it's not as hot. To the, to the right of the bed over here, you have massive shirt closets. So you have hanging wardrobes on both sides of the bed and then you actually have a good amount of storage above the bed as well. You also have tons of outlets. So about 80% of Crossroads employees are Amish. So you'd think that maybe they don't work with electricity a whole bunch, but that's just not accurate because you're gonna notice you have tons of outlets in this unit. You have outlets not on just one, but on both sides of your bed. So if you have sleep app machines, you know, alarm clocks, which you know, some of us don't like to use. You also have two USB charging ports. So you can plug in your phone. Everybody has to charge their phones at night. So it's kind of critical that you have it, believe it or not. There's a lot of trailers out there that don't have USB charging ports, but the Zinger comes standard with that. 
And actually, when we're leaving, I just want to show you how they actually have pocket doors in the Zinger Travel Trailer Standard. This is a big deal, folks. It's nice for privacy, but the other brands, what they actually use is just a cheap curtain, not the Zinger. Actually has pocket solid doors. So it's nice for privacy. It's more residential feel. And then let's talk about your AC ducts. Right up top, you actually have a nice, awesome AC duct that drops down your bedroom. It actually has a directional, which actually that feels really good right now because we do have it on. It's thermostatically controlled. It's a 13,500 B2 ducted air conditioning. The reason why I'm talking about the thermostatically controlled because a lot of units, um, I guess you could say it's a race to the bottom. Some of the manufacturers don't put thermostatically controlled air conditioners on their units. So you always have to get up in the middle of the night to adjust the air conditioning. But with the Zinger, you don't have to do that. And then you have the directional. So if you do like the AC in the middle of the night blowing on you, and maybe your wife doesn't, or your partner, you can actually adjust it accordingly. Coming on over to the living room, this unit actually comes with a huge, huge U dinette. So you can actually sit the whole family around it. It drops down for sleeping as well. But just down below, you'll notice it actually has not just one, but actually has two cabinet doors. So it's just ease of access to get to your uh, things. Above the dinette, you'll notice, of course, we all have our phones on us nowadays. You always need to be charged up and connected. Zinger is going to help you with that with two additional USB charging ports over the dinette area. To the right of that, Zinger actually comes standard with wooden blinds. This is awesome because it's a residential feel. A lot of brands put the cheap metal mini blinds in there. They shake, they rattle, they bend, and they don't look good. But the, uh, the Zinger is just a little different. It actually has wooden blinds, which are super easy to use and they're just a nicer look than the cheap metal mini blinds that you'll find and when you walk in the unit they're not going to be rattling around like the other trailers do the neat thing about this slide room is you have stainless steel appliances as well so it actually has six cubic foot refrigerator with stainless steel appliances massive massive amounts of storage in there above that in the slide room all the slide rooms are built with beefy headers over the slide out box itself. So when this slide room comes in and out, you want to make sure that that hole is, stays nice and true and you're not going to have any issues with binding or anything. That header is going to help keep a nice flush seal and let those bulb seals that we talked about earlier do their job. The other neat thing that actually Zinger does, a lot of manufacturers don't do it, they also put the mood lighting above your slide out just makes it look really cool. You can either have them on or off. Um, coming down to the floor, just want to talk about this for a quick minute. Neat thing here, you'll notice all your heat ducts are in the floor. The cool thing with the heat ducts in the floor, folks, is it gives you more storage above the floor and actually gives you almost like a radiant heating floor. Remember earlier when we were outside the unit, we talked about the heated and enclosed underbelly. So all the duct work is outside and inside of the unit for maximum comfort. But putting your heat ducts below the floor gives you the ability to have more storage above the floor. So you'll notice in the kitchen area here, you have one, two, three massive storage drawers with metal ball bearings. And then it also has a stainless steel hardware package, gives it a nice modern look to it. And you have additional storage for massive pots and pans down below here as well. So you have one and then you have a massive shelf that goes back really, really, really far. You can almost get lost in there. The other neat thing, it also, they give you some additional lighting just below the sink. The sink is something just awesome to, to talk about here because a lot of brands put the very shallow sinks in, not the Zinger. You have deep, deep bowl sinks. It's actually a 60-40 sink. So if you have bigger pots and pans, you can clean them up over here, dry them over here. And then look at look how beefy and substantial this faucet is. I mean, for an actual RV, I feel like I'm in like a million dollar house with this faucet. I mean, it's all metal instead of plastic and it's a gooseneck so you can actually fit 
real life items underneath your faucets. So there's a lot of utility here. Look at all the counter space. You have tons of counter space here. You have a switch for your actual microwave or your fireplace here. Down below, before we forget, I'm, I'm sorry, I almost, there's so many features, I don't wanna miss them. This actually comes with a Furion 30 inch glass front recessed fireplace. It actually heats up to 500 square feet. It gives a nice mood lighting as well with LED lights and flames. Swing back over to the kitchen. Again, you have your stainless steel residential package. So your microwaves encased in stainless steel and your oven. A lot of brands don't give you an oven nowadays. I, I don't know why, but my wife cooks a lot. It's kind of important to have an oven. So they actually give that to you at no additional charge. And then you have a three burner cooktop with a high output range out front here. Just behind that, you actually have a tile backsplash. It's easy to clean, it's more residential, and a lot of brands, believe it or not, put like cheap stickers here. You know, I, I think they could probably catch fire. Uh, you're not gonna have to worry about that with the actual residential tile that the Zinger actually gives you. Let's just take a look over here. When I thought we were done with the storage, guess again. I mean, look at the storage here. You can put tons of items in here from kitchenware, clothing, you name it. You just have a massive pantry, wardrobe. You have lighting in here, adjustable shelves. That's awesome. You can even make it a mud room if you want. Uh, just behind me, again, you have more storage. I mean, it's just coming at me from every angle. There's storage underneath the dinette seating, storage behind me here, and you actually have shelves here. Costs extra money to build it with the shelves, but Zinger is not gonna you know, cut any corners there. This unit actually is a bunk model. This one's called actually the 258. The neat thing about these bunks, if you can get a good shot down below, you'll notice you have good storage. And then the bunk, it's rated for 300 pounds as opposed to 150 or 200 pounds. So Zinger gives you a more beefier construction, enabling you to put, you know, bigger adults on the bunks, or if you use it for storage, um, you know, you have a load capacity of 300 pounds. That's a big deal. Uh, and then you actually have, so people don't feel closed in, you actually have massive windows in both bunks. Some brands I'll go into folks and they'll not put any bunk, not put any windows. That's just kind of strange to me. Uh, to actually put a, a human in a bunk room and then just have like it all closed in with no windows. Zinger's not gonna do that. No charge for all the windows. That's a big deal. We talked about the thermostatically controlled AC, so you can actually adjust that accordingly high and low and then you also have a fan speed come standard with the zinger at that sale price look how huge this bathroom is folks this bathroom has tons of storage you have a huge wooden medicine cabinet phenom you have like counter space for days in here in this bathroom you have extra outlets here you have your little light switch look how huge this this shower is this shower is just massive you can actually stretch out in here. You have a, a one piece shower surround, so you're not gonna get any water leaks. When you step out of the shower, you can actually towel off. It's a good sized bathroom. So that was the all new Zinger by Crossroads. Thank you very much for your time today. If you have any other questions, feel free to give us a call or check us out online at rv1.com. Thank you.